the formidable robot. On March 5, 2000, a night like any other, families across the nation tuned into their television sets, eager to catch the latest episode of the beloved animated sitcom, Family Guy. Little did they know, that night would become etched in their memories for all the wrong reasons. As the clock struck the hour, the familiar theme song began to play, and viewers settled in for another round of laughter. But something was off. The animation seemed distorted, the colors muted, and a palpable sense of unease hung in the air. Midway through the episode, the screen flickered, and the sound distorted into an eerie static. Viewers squinted at their screens, trying to make sense of what was happening. Then, without warning, the image shifted to something altogether horrifying. The Griffin family, beloved characters of the show, were depicted in a grotesque and macabre manner. Their once jovial faces contorted into expressions of agony and despair. Blood dripped from their lifeless eyes as they stared vacantly into the void. The scene was a nightmarish tableau, a twisted mockery of the beloved sitcom. Panic erupted across the nation as viewers scrambled to turn off their televisions, but for many, it was already too late. The hijack had unleashed a torrent of terror that would haunt them for years to come. In the aftermath of the hijack, the true extent of the horror became apparent. Around 155 people took their own lives in the days following the broadcast, unable to cope with the trauma inflicted upon them. Another 130 vanished without a trace, leaving behind only empty homes and unanswered questions. Those who survived the ordeal were forever changed. 86 people refused to speak of what they had witnessed, their eyes haunted by the memories they could not erase. But for a select few, the nightmare was far from over. 45 individuals claimed to have recorded the hijack and sent tapes to paranormal investigators in a desperate bid for answers. Some hoped to find closure, while others sought vindication for their shattered sanity. But as the years passed, the tapes disappeared without a trace, leaving behind only whispers of the horrors they contained. To this day, the events of March 5, 2000, remain shrouded in mystery. Was it a sinister act of sabotage, a glitch in the broadcast, or something far more sinister? The truth may never be known, but one thing is certain. The night the Griffin family's smiles turned to screams will never be forgotten.